So we've arrived in Berlin for the second leg of our Germany weekend, uh, set to watch Hertha Berlin versus Eintracht Frankfurt today. I haven't been in Munich for the last couple of days with uh, Harry, who's been uh, asleep on the on the flight. Rightly so. I've uh, just realised uh, I've got my Bayern Munich shirt on, yeah. which I haven't really planned for, because <laughs> famously I was wearing it walking into the Hanover and yesterday got it got told to take it off. Uh, and I'm wearing it now, walking into what it, what could be any end, yeah. home or away, uh, at the Olympic Stadium later. So. And apparently there's not much to do around the stadium, so it looks like we're going to be hanging around in town for most of the uh, afternoon. Get a couple of curryverse down us, I'm sure. Um, but you know, it doesn't take away from my excitement. I think, uh, I think as far as the game's concerned, it might be better than Bayern Munich. It was a bit one-sided yesterday, although the, the, the town itself, you know, the, the nights out were great in Munich. Let's hope for uh, a similar sort of uh, occasion here. Here we are. Outside the stadium, lovely chilled atmosphere, people drinking beers, chatting amongst their mates, all very chilled out, much unlike other countries, top tier football. I like it. If there's a man that's happy about a sweet, a sweet stall at a football ground, it's the, the, the man behind me right here. What are your thoughts? Oh, this is, this is brilliant. I was, I was all sort of disappointed when I saw pretzels. Uh, I was eyeing up hot chocolate, but this is, uh, this is just what I was after. Yeah, it's like a festival atmosphere, like it's just, just stalls, you can just wander in and out of the ground, come outside again, get a beer, wander back in with it. I mean, I'm definitely going back in. Let's have a look at some of the other food stalls. We've got pretzels, uh, hot dogs, of course. It is freezing. It is freezing, it's snowing. Uh, but the fact you can just walk around, I've got, I've got a literal jug of beer in my hand. And just wandering freely around the stadium with 20 minutes to go. You can just wander back in at any point. <laughs> Quite a boring first 15 minutes, it's now one all. Lovely, got lovely equaliser from Frankfurt after they offered absolutely nothing to start with. Uh, straight from a corner, um, past the edge of the box and rammed into the top corner. Wonderful, wonderful goal. And a decent game. Yeah, go on. Honestly, not exaggerating when I say this is the coldest stadium in Europe right now. It's snowing. Uh, God knows what the temperature is, but oh my God, it's absolutely freezing. So much so that I've hardly been to concentrate on the game. So much so that I'm not enjoying it that much uh, compared to yesterday. Uh, but no, it, it is great. It's a great stadium. Um, to see that you know everything they got in place, the people bringing beers around just for half time is brilliant. I wish I, just, I really wish England was like that. Um, I wish home crowds were as loud as these Berlin fans are. Um, the football's not brilliant, it's, it's okay. Uh, but it is absolutely freezing. One all at half time. Um, as I say, a great equaliser from Frankfurt after Berlin were on top for uh, most of the early exchanges. Um, 
it's quieting down the last sort of 10 minutes to the first half, a bit bitty. Um, but obviously, second half, Hertha attacking the home end should be good, good fun. Uh, hopefully, they can score a goal down there, and hopefully, it's entertaining. Hopefully, it warms up. Uh, then we're going to head back into town afterwards. I'm looking forward to everything that uh, beckons, but it's really got to get a lot warmer around here. There you go. Just realised I've, I've completely neglected the vlog for about five hours, so we've just been to a cocktail bar, done six shots each of just completely random stuff. Now on our way to an Irish bar where we're going to probably finish the night. Um, football's really good today, uh, the ground was great, the atmosphere was great, Berlin's been great. Um, obviously a quiet evening, but it being a Sunday, but uh, into this Irish bar we go, probably some more shots to follow, and uh, let's see how we get on. What are you putting forward? A beer chen. Now we're not sure what it is. It looks like an Amstel. I'm putting forward what I think is the Voudini, which is a right. vodka lemon concoction. I've right. got a curry verse in front of me. I'm going for it now. You ready? Here we go. I can't stop with that. Oh, drink, drink, drink. Here we go. I can't stop with that. Like that. No, put it inside and drink. Put it in quick. No. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Drink, drink, drink. Don't stop, don't stop. Drink, drink, drink. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Drink, drink. Yeah. Good gentlemen. <laughs> Looks in the eyes. One second, and the ice is a little bit glassy. And it is why the alcohol goes on the lungs, and the ice it's a little bit glassy. Right. Yeah. And was heavy or was normal? Normal. Fine. Dreadful airport. No positive reviews. <laughs> the gates are crap. And they're also just there. That is a positive issue. I like the fact that it's so accessible. So that was Berlin. That was a, a great trip. I'm back in England now. Um, yeah, so we had, we had a night out obviously on, on, on the Sunday. We had a few drinks on the, on the Monday. Went to the Hofbrau house for a nice meal. Flew back in the evening and it's now middle of the week. And uh, thoroughly enjoyed it. Would definitely go back, usual stuff. Um, make sure you check out the Munich vlog if you haven't already. Uh, but make sure you subscribe if you're new. Loads more of these to come. Main, you know, mainly Liverpool stuff, but there might be the odd foreign escapade in there, just like this one. So I hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, please. Follow me at the socials too. It's Ben might say on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Facebook. And I'll see you in the next one.